It has been a week since Happy Logo Day, which happened to fall on Wedding Wednesday. And I feel absolutely fantastic with where I am. Um, at the moment, in the gym, at present, and I think mentally I am okay with being single and I'm married. I'm okay with it. But I'm determined to carry on in the direction of getting sexy on Wedding Wednesday and talking to you guys about all the amazing products and services that I've used to help me in the direction of getting sexy on Wedding Wednesday, the journey to marriage as part of quality of life. So as you can see, I haven't tackled the forehead yet at all. I mean, I don't really care about the pigmentation. That's not the problem, it's the breakouts. I've never had breakouts like this. And when I have had breakouts to almost the same degree, it's because I've been wearing fringes and obviously all the oil and the products from the hair just get into the pores. And so I'm gonna go on a little hunt and see what new product I can try. And I've seen a fantastic advert that keeps popping up when I'm having some me time watching some TV. And I think I'm gonna go for it. And I'm gonna go for that product and see how it goes for the week because so far I have chose, I've used two products from the same brand, the same beauty brand, and I haven't had a flare up, so I might be alright. So and I won't be moving on to the subject of my hair, getting my hair sexy, my natural dresses. But I will be saying goodbye to the week. Yeah, definitely going to be saying goodbye to the week. And then I'm going to just keep my eye out on for some products that can help me to manage my afro hair because it's been so long since I've had my natural tresses for this direct for like for this duration of my life i've never been this natural with this length ever so yeah just getting ready to go to the health and beauty store aka pharmacist see if i can get myself something to tackle the breakouts on my forehead on a weekly basis. As you can see, the rash has gone down and the swelling from the allergic reaction has gone down. I'm very happy with that. So much in this direction that I've got to tackle. So I thought I would just give you a little vlog in the gym. And yeah. I have to embrace who I am right now. I have to acknowledge my beauty, me in my entirety. I have to acknowledge it and accept it. Yes, I accept I've neglected my skin, probably with all the insecurities I had about my hair. So what it boils down to is the insecurities that I've had with my hair have affected my skin. But I I could be procrastinating and not prioritising well because I want to deal with this because if I'm going to wear my natural treasure, dresses, whether I do an occasional wig, weave or whatever, this has to be intact and it's never been so bad, you know? I knew the skin rash, the allergic reaction, within seven days it would disappear. It's always been like that. But this is something new. This forehead problem at the moment that I'm having went into good old trusty boots and looked at the selection of different cleansing water that's available and I'm going to try this one, see if this one can get rid of the breakout that I've been having. So it says it lasts 200 uses and it was on special offer which is fucking fantastic. So. I just drench that pad a little. And just give my forehead a good clean. 
Oh God, I have actually just come from swimming. I didn't have a shower, but that's a lot of grime. I wonder how many weeks or months it takes or days to see. Yeah. Results. It's there's stuff for oily, combination, dry, sensitive, all of it. But I chose this one because it has no perfume in it and I've got the old eczema and it says it's good enough even for sensitive skin. Um, I'm going to forget the makeup routine for a long while while I'm treating my forehead. It cleanses, it soothes and I don't have to rinse. So yeah, I'm pretty okay with what's left on the last one. That's not so grimy. If you see the first one, oh my god, that was a lot right there. So, if you're looking for an effective, gentle and easy to use cleanser, try Garnier Cleansing Water. <laughs> it just one step removes makeup, impurities, dirt and dirt while soothing even sensitive skin. And it's recognised by the British Skin Foundation and Allergy UK. So... God, I'm going to have to think of how to moisturise this forehead. So it's got botanical glyrosin, a well-known hydrating active to moisturise the skin. Okay. We, we use, wherever possible, active ingredients from nature, antitoxins, and combine them with well-known skincare actives. So the result, perfectly cleansed, soothe skin without rubbing or rinsing. How to use it? Apply onto a cotton pad, which I did. Wipe the face. I'm only going to do it with the forehead because that is the problem area at the moment. And it should last me 200 uses. It doesn't say whether morning or night. So I think I'll tr I will do the morning or night, definitely. Or I might do after swimming and before bed, yeah. Well, for the moment. My routine calls for after after swimming and before bed. Okay. Well, there we go. So, how does my skin feel? A little tingly and a little tight. But I'm not so bothered about that for now. I just want to get rid of the, the breakout, man. That's got to go. Okay, so that's what I'm staying with. The Garnier Skin Active Range. Micular. Cleansing water. 